Thank you very much indeed. Um, well, first of all, welcome to uh, Kedron, and uh, just to provide you with a brief uh, roundup on where we are currently situated with the uh, flooding situation. At the moment, we're long reach um, alpha. The electricians have been through a majority of those houses now, and they're starting to return to normal. They're working on some of the utilities, and the same with alpha. So those two communities are well entrenched into uh, recovery mode. Moving on to Dolby, we're looking at still some road closures in those areas there, and some of the uh, road closures uh, will start to uh, will start to improve as the water levels start to drop. It is important to remember that a lot of those road closures still need to be inspected before they can be opened, so although there may not be any water across bridges, the approaches to, and, uh, to the bridges and the bridges themselves need to be inspected so that they can be assured uh, for safety for uh, vehicle travel. In Dolby, we're also looking at the resupply of a number of uh, smaller communities around uh, Tara, and uh, fuel in that particular area is being addressed and same with Chinchilla and the water, water uh, issues that have been challenging for the area are still being addressed. They're looking at repairing uh, the uh, water treatment uh, area at Dolby and they're also still uh, trucking water to the town. There are water restrictions in the town. We ask people to be patient. Those, uh, those restrictions will last for a few more days until those repairs can be effected. Moving on up, we're looking at Roma, and uh, Roma are reporting uh, no issues at the moment, but Surat is preparing.